Veganism is a moral imperative. It is not a diet. Veganism is about the animals. Veganism is not about being selfish. It is about causing the least amount of harm possible on the planet. It is about not causing extremely amount of suffering to innocent animals who don't want or don't be on this planet for your pleasure over a couple of seconds. There are living beings who are just like women, just like blacks, are not here. And I repeat, not here. To be turned in commodities. They are, are existing for their own reasons. And that's not to serve us or being turned in a commodity for us. I'm sick and tired of hearing all the excuses that are also used by slave masters like Haman, the governor of the South in the 19th century America. I'm sick and tired of all the bigoted bullshit or must I say hominid shit of all the people who claim that only our species deserve any protection or any respect whatsoever. It is time to look things from the victim's point of view. You are not the one with a knife on your throat, forced to be tormented, forced to be murdered. You don't do the murder yourself. But this does not mean that you are not responsible. When you pay a hitman in the law system, according to the law, you are also responsible for that. Then it is called murder by proxy. Proxy murder. You have also um, rape by proxy. That's also some sick thing. Some people do in gangs. Or in the mafia way of the government sometimes. Oh yeah. I'm supposed to believe there are honest, good working people. That we know love. There are gangsters in the in the governments. There are oh Turks. America, Russia, North Korea, everywhere. The politicians don't give an F about you. They don't give an F about me or your family, your grandmother, your grandfather, your sister, your brother. They don't give an F about you. They're only interested in this. Viewing the economy. Feeding his beast master. The corporate cronies. Go vegan or don't ask for any more money yourself. How can you ask for something you are not willing to give? It is not a great thing. It is the least amount of a thing you can do for them. Veganism, don't consume animal body parts and secretions and things that are ripped from their body, called leather. Not to committing extreme amounts of cruelty to them is the least amount of harm. There's the least amount of thing you can do to deserve any mercy at all. Animals are not here to be your food, your clothing or your entertainment. Animals are here 
for their own reasons, for their own existence, for their own happiness. There are not commodities, there are not things, there are not unthinking automatons. And if you not believe me, check out the Cambridge Declaration of Consciousness of a bunch of scientists who actually proved that the animals, at least all mammals, most kinds of marine animals also, and octopuses, and many other animals are sensuous and aware to the degree that we claim that we are. Are you going to debate with logic or science? If you do, then you are a dickhead. If they're flying, if they're flying in a fee formation, if they can locate water when they are thirsty, if they protect each other from danger, like many animals do, if they're can hide where they're not want to be seen. That are not instinctual behaviors. That are thoughts connected with um, actions. That are not instinct. Do you know what being instinct? Reading. That's instinct. The majority of other things are logical behaviors. Where can we go with, with claiming that we are so smart and so aware when the only thing we do is destroying our own environment, destroying the whole ecosystem? Only for some pleasures, entertainment, enjoyment. Sounds not to me like the actions of a sane species or a moral species. Sounds more like the acts of a maniac. Indeed, my observations of the species is not so get not so good result not so nice result i say i must also say that my observations have shown me clearly that man is not the reasoning animal actually my observations have proved to me that he is the unreasonable animal. He is the only one who creates his own reality, his own matrix. He lied to himself and to others. He deceived himself in believing his own arbitrary sub science, his bro science and take it if it be in reality, his own bro reality, at least, that's how the most sound. If you are disagreeing with this opinion, then I ask you to debunk my position that we are worthless. We are the only animal house disappearing will benefit anything in existence. It's a fact, not my opinion. When bees and other pollinators disappear, the whole food web will be extremely negative affected by it. Since 78% of all the animals on the planet are herbivores. Since 80% of all the plants on the planet need some form of 
pollination. It is not a brainer that their disappearing will extremely affect the world in a negative way. When phytoplankton, tiny marine plants, are disappearing, all are responsible for 70% of all the oxygen on Earth. There will not be much higher life possible, since 70% since of the oxygen on the planet will disappear. And they are disappearing because of um, fishing, and whaling, and other forms of eco-terrorism. But particular animal agriculture, um, fishing, and aquaculture, fishing farms, in other words. Veganism may give people actually a chance to do something positive for the world, instead of paying the road to hell with good attentions. Playing lip service to all problems on the planet, we are not active playing a part in ending where you only want to get goodies from. Veganism may give you actually a chance to do something. Since 51% um, of all the greenhouse gas emissions come from animal agriculture, since 91% uh, of all the deforestation is because of animal agriculture, since around 84% percent of all the animals raised on the planet for consumption of hominids, your species, is fed to livestock animals and those animals are living in countries where the feeders feed to the livestock. So how ridiculous will you be to defend your physician? Are you so narcissistic that you think your diet choice is more important than the life of billions of innocent animals, the environment, the planet, and even your members of your own species from another country? How sick, pathetic and fucked up are you? With a sick, ridiculous puppet you are. Dancing, fucking, not caring about the world, not knowing you are nothing. You are not what was intended.